Good morning. It's an absolutely terrible day, both in Busan and all over Korea. Pouring down rain, which is fine with us because we're taking the high-speed train from Busan back to Seoul. So no worries about that. I believe it's a two and a half hour train ride. Let's go. Pouring rain. Here we are at the Busan train station. It took one hour in the rain to get here. Our train leaves at 11 o'clock and the train number is 132. We're not on the board yet, we're too early. This is what our e-ticket looks like. We'll be in car one, seats 14A and 14B. 30 minutes before the train is supposed to depart, they light them up and you just head toward the different tracks. They I just hope they make it as easy to get around Japan as they do here in Korea. Even Dolty, duh, me, can figure it out. I don't think you can ask for a nicer train station. Or more user-friendly. We got some really good sweet rolls at Paris Baguette yesterday. Our train is up there now. It leaves at 11 o'clock, but they're busy boarding 10.15 to Seoul. Yeah, the numbers of the cars down there as well as up there. Car one. Well, it doesn't resemble the Japanese bullet trains. We're going to be in Seoul for four more full days and the weather is supposed to be good. So we'll let it finish raining itself out today. Welcome aboard the KTX now for Seoul. We will do our best to make your journey as comfortable as possible. The train goes through lots and lots of long tunnels. Bursts out of a tunnel, you see an occasional countryside back into another tunnel. The train is going to stop in Tong Dosa Station where we where we stopped on the way to Busan to see the gorgeous temple. A really unusual way of checking tickets. You don't have to take out your tickets at all. The man walks by with his little electronic who's it? He knows exactly who's supposed to be sitting in every single seat. You gotta help you if you're in the wrong seat. It's not a very scenic ride. Skirts of Seoul. Korea is, is such a small country that there's only one way to go, and that's up. I've counted as many as 12 buildings and some complexes. Take a look at this train station. A Four Seasons hotel just opened up today. There's these gates. Our hotel's be right around here. 